hello everyone welcome to the design pantry channel here we are looking at a cute bedroom a kid's bedroom in the blair model home by madame e. homes we also have another bedroom here well this is actually a still shot of the owner's suite for the blair model now we're gonna head upstairs to check out the second level of this home which is carpeted. I love the um, green and white banister on the staircase to the left and the right. As soon as you walk upstairs to the second floor, you have that artwork on the wall and the laundry room is off to your left. You have added um, cabinet storage up above and of course enough room for both your washer and dryer. You can add um, additional furniture or a little stand if you want. That's not coming with the house. That's just there for the um, model home, of course. It's just decoration. But you can always add your own furniture pieces. Let's check out the rooms on this floor. This is the owner's suite. Here you have a full view of the bedroom with lots and lots of natural lighting. And here is a look at the shower with the glass surround. There's the his and her sinks. I like the modern um, color choices in this model home. The bathroom is enclosed, so you have privacy. As far as the toilet use is concerned. And there's also views of the community and the linen closet in this bathroom, of course. It's a nice height. It's not too wide, but there's enough storage. Um, here's a peek at the woods in the community this community i believe is in the second phase so there's a lot more building to be done in this home in this um subdivision i'm sorry here's another look at the bathroom which has a little bench for you to sit down shave your legs exfoliate whatever it is that you want to do while sitting in the shower i love the glass inserts there in the corner for you to place your um, body wash, soaps, whatever it is that you need. This is the closet and the owner suite. It's like a U-shaped closet. Decent amount of space. Mm -hmm. We're headed down the hall to check out the rest of the rooms on this floor. Now we're going to enter the bathroom, the full bathroom that's on the second floor, which has um, his and her sinks. Love the color choices in the bathroom. You have a bathtub off to your left there, a shower, standing shower in the tub. And um, here's another peek of the community. I like how the homes at the end, like at the far right, have columns in the front. I don't know if you could see it from here, but the fifth home on the right there, where I've just circled, has columns in the very front, like brick columns. I think that's a nice added touch. That home is called a Clifton model. Now we can finish checking out the rest of the bathroom linen closet that's in this bathroom decent amount of storage space remember this is the second linen closet on this floor and now we are going to exit that bathroom and check out the other two bedrooms that are on the second floor of this home we have this staged as an office space slash workout um area which you could do the same or just use it 
as a bedroom if you'd like. Hustle for the muscle. Um, here's the views of the space in the room and the items that they have in it. There you see the office area, the, the work area, the desk space. And you also get peeks of the community through the window there so you can see what the front of the home, townhomes in the subdivision look like. I love that mirror. Get to see a reflection of the room through the mirror. Um, here's the other bedroom. This is what we started off the video with. This cute little girl's room that's decorated nicely in pink. And now I'm going to give you a closer look at the front of the homes. Each building contains about four or five um, townhomes. I think it's five townhomes altogether. Sorry, four townhomes. Four townhomes. Now we are looking at the kitchen on the first floor of the Blair model. Here's a walkthrough of the first floor of the Blair. Here you have your kitchen space. Nice modern finishes. Simple design. But it's clean. It's brand new. And these homes are starting in the low 400s. Now we're heading down the foyer towards the front door of the um, a model. So you'll notice you walk in through the front and then the staircase is off to your right where we saw the bedrooms earlier. But here's the open living space. You have your dining area, your living room area. And then there's a door leading out to the backyard. The back patio is um, cemented, of course, and um, I don't believe you can um, fence off the property back here, but right where you see that pink flag on the corner, that would be the ends of your property line, so you can do whatever you want up until that area. And here is a, another little walkthrough of the kitchen space we're going to head to the um, bathroom the half bath that's on the first floor you can make this a little office space where I'm standing now um, this model is equipped for a handicapped bathroom but of course all models will have that here's the living room area and another still shot of the bedrooms that are upstairs, the additional bedrooms on the second floor. I really want to thank you so much for watching. This is what one of the front elevations of the Blair model can look like, and this community is in Indian Land, South Carolina, not too far from Charlotte.